Okay, so back to Ren, man. Ren has dropped a brand new track called Lost All Faith. Now, I'm not going to be doing this one alone. I've got a special guest with me to react to this track with me. Some of you might know him, some of you might not know him. He's a new addition to the Fable Sphere, one of many that will be added to the Fable Sphere. But uh, yeah, pull in. Let's see. So, what's happening, man? What's happening, bro? How's it going? Hello, yeah. everyone. How are you doing? Good. <laughs> Welcome to Fable Perfect. Sphere, man. Some of them, uh, some of them might know you from uh, your channel. I'm pr probably sure, like the majority of them, you've had probably. a couple of thousand views. Properly, a couple of thousand, couple of, of thousand. You, but views. that's but that's the that's the renegade. That's the, a renegade, the renegade squad, uh, squad that the, comes uh, that comes into it. This is brand new. We haven't heard either one of these um, before. We actually get into this. Um, I've, look, I've reacted to a couple of Ren's tracks. The ones that you've just recently reacted to. What do you think, Hi Ren? Let's just. Oh, Hi Ren, man. Hi Ren is just. It blows your damn mind, man. I mean, just the scenario of of him with the two characters, obviously talking to himself and no, everything it's, it's like absolutely that. Brilliant. And I mean, his background, bro. It's just so simplistic. It's so awesome, bro. But the thing I... that strikes me most is that guitar, man. That guitar is that so okay, fantastic. That okay, guitar, it's it's just, actually for a very sort of simple sp uh, space, like you went very minimalistic with it. Yeah. But the actual lighting and the eroding of the background is just fucking amazing. And because the lights going on and off. It's spoken into the, the eroding of his psyche, absolutely. which I thought was absolutely, absolutely brilliant. Absolutely. Such a good track. Uh, uh, the Tale of Jenny and Screech. I watched that one of yours. <laughs> 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 yeah, I saw him. It was late, man. I saw. I saw. <laughs> in, I saw that you noticed in post edit. <laughs> 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 Yeah. Where I was dribbling a bit, but it was good. It was but good. It was, was a late night. Sick boy, absolutely fantastic. Sick boy was just incredible, man. Talking to the psychiatrist and how 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 he was talking to the psychiatrist backwards. Of, oh, it was just brilliant. Dude. Chalk outlines. Oh man. Chalk outlines. Like that's, chalk that's, outlines. Uh, chalk, yeah, the chalk outlines. Just chalk, the, chalk I, outlines. I have nothing to say. I, I don't want to say it's my favorite. But it could possibly be. I think possibly it probably is one of my favorites. Suicide, suicide, suicide. Um, suicide. Was I, no, yeah, no, no, but you've, you've reacted to it, but you haven't dropped it yet. Oh, is it? Yeah, okay, yeah. well, yeah, I've reacted so, to it. I'll, but I'll, it's coming. It's in edit, so. It's coming, it's coming. Uh, yeah, it's what coming. What is this, though? Now? Okay, so this is uh, Lost All Faith. Yeah, I think dropped this about 17, 18 hours ago. Jeez, like, so this is brand spanking. So this is man. brand, brand. Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! He's, actually, he's actually dropped quite a few um, tracks. That, look, that I've missed. I've been so busy with series um, that I've missed a couple of them. So we'll probably jump onto those at some point. Hundreds. But, um, hey, man, now that you're at least a little bit of fail with Ren, Let's, let's uh, see what's going on, right? Yeah. Let's see what's uh, going on. Ren lost all faith. Let's uh, let's see what we got. This beat is fucking mad. Wait a second. I like the fact that he's also like playing in terms of like the train station. Yeah, yeah. And uh, um, where it's like, okay, like he doesn't want to be rude, but you know, fans can sometimes just yeah. be a little bit like intrusive. And it's like, okay, oh, well, you know what? Let, let me just do it. Like he's just, just that kind of guy, yeah. you know? But uh, sorry, I just start this from the beginning because that fucking beat is crazy. Mate, I'm in a bit of a rush right now. You're a sick guy. Oh, thanks, mate. I've, I've, yeah, I've, I've, you're a sick boy. I've, I've got to get out of train, mate. I'm really sorry. Mate, I'm talking to you like, hey. Jeez, do you remember Nigella Lawson by yes, any chance? She's, I think she, she must be a British. Uh, she was a British chef. She used to do those. Um, she, those, but she was very she is British. I didn't know she was a chef. No, no, Nigella Lawson was a chef. Then I'm not talking about and, her. Uh, she, she yeah. was, look, I, I just thought she was absolutely gorgeous. That's oh, why. No, she's a very pretty woman. And oh, she did cooking, so I mean, I guess she's, well, yeah, yeah, she, down she's checking two. <laughs> she's checking two, uh, you know, she's ticking two, uh, two uh, boxes. So. Two, two out of the two. Yeah, um, but okay. So I, I love the fact that he said that about this, the Stella Stella. 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 Stella.
the reason why he did that is because he's sick and he gets sick from kebabs from the chicken. Yeah, yeah. So like, listen, he's so used to getting, he's so used to getting, getting sick, uh, yeah. sick that he's like kebabs and salmonella. That's so it's almost good. like, it's like him being sick is like his permanent state. Yeah, so yeah. it's very clever line there. I should really, really. For the weekend, I took back to Salmonella, Cinderella, story racks to bitches, minute full propeller. I'm Nigella, Lawson, stuck in mozzarella. Only joking, I'm an introvert, alone inside my room because my insides hurt. I contemplate existence. Wait a second, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. I'm an introvert, alone inside my room. Nigella, Cinderella, story racks to bitches, minute full propeller. I'm Nigella, Lawson, stuck in mozzarella. Only joking, I'm an introvert, alone inside my room because my insides hurt. I'm an introvert alone inside my room because my insides hurt. The actual scheme on that is absolutely ridiculous. I'm an introvert alone inside my room because my insides hurt. You, you so know, it's actually confined and confined. You know why this oak actually blows my mind? It's not only his wording and his lyrics and everything that he does, right? But the second he opens his mouth, you know it's in. It just, oh, yeah, it, yeah, yeah. It just, he's it's just got a way very distinct sound. Absolutely. You can yeah. literally say a word and you'll know it's him. Oh, 100%. Yeah. That's what I, I, I love. I completely it. agree with you on that one. Absolutely. Let's just do it. Ella Lawson stuck in mozzarella. Only joking, I'm an introvert. Alone inside my room because my insides hurt. I contemplate existence with consistence in my polo shirt. And reassert my confidence with compliments I don't deserve. I calm my nerves by plotting today that I might leave this earth. I lift up my eyes to the hills. Pain is my shepherd, my sword and my shield. Jesus. I find my refuge in patience and pills. A patient that's patiently waiting for help. I don't ever seem to feel well. Can anybody save me from myself? There's blood on the leaves where I fell. Coming down. This might, might be one of my, my new favorites. I'm this is honest. unbelievable, bro. You have to go back. You have to, have to, have to go back. Shit. Where he puts his... Uh, no, but this even this oh. where he actually... Uh, um, where he literally cuts out that beat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then it flows and he, back and, he, and he, it's like... It almost feels like he's going into like a bit of a serene side of him. But that sort of serene side of him is actually a very isolated side. It's actually... A, it's, it's, it's darker than you think. Specifically with the words. I think it's... He, he's also quite closed off still. Like, he, he shares a lot of himself. But it's also, I love that when he actually starts singing. I yeah. actually love that because he, he actually strikes you, he pushes that emotion out of him, man. Jeez, but it that's... just hurts, man. Because, I mean, knowing what he's been through. Yeah. Jeez, like, bro. It's just good. I lift up my eyes to the hills. Pain is my shepherd, my sword and my shield. I find my refuge in patience and pills. A patient that's patiently waiting for help. I find my so, refuge in in I find my uh, my refuge in patience in pull a patience that's waiting but a patient patience yes hundred percent so just clever. go back again just go back again if you don't mind one yeah, more yeah yeah I don't mind Arthur <laughs> yeah, well, if you don't mind uh, well they, they have no choice we've got the we've got the space we got the space yes 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 <laughs> my eyes to the hills pain is my shepherd my sword and my shield yes. I find my refuge in patience and pills pain is my refuge my refuge yeah my sword and my shield. This is actually biblical. Yeah, 100%. It's 100%. Yeah. Biblical. I, he's not so this is actually the armor of God what I do that, like, that they talk what about. I, what I do like about Ren is that he's actually not, even if you listen to other music of his, he's not particularly directed into like, into like biblical stances, 100%. Bi biblical doctrines. But he's godly. No, but he does take, he does take um, parts of scripture out yeah. to sort of, um, sort of uh, um, capture capture what he's actually correct. Capture to the say. essence of what he's trying to say. He's incredible, which I think is absolutely brilliant. Because I think he's also trying to take a neutral stance in the sense that whatever religion, one, one of my favorite sayings is whatever religion, um, the best religion in the world is whatever you believe in, mm. whatever gives you hope. At the end of the day, and I think he really tries to tread that line specifically with his audience, where he'll take parts of scripture yeah. and literally put it into uh, um, a track. I just like the fact that he takes to, parts of scripture, man. You know, yeah, I'm, um, um, yeah, I'm, not, I'm not entirely sure if it's, it's, it's intentional. I, I, most of what Ren does is intentional. I feel, yeah, pretty, it's let's intentional, see. bro. Even, let's he, see. even some of his other tracks, there's lots yeah. of stuff that is biblical, bro. Yeah, let's, let's uh, go. let's go. On. A patient that's patiently waiting for help. I don't ever seem to feel well. Can anybody that. save me from myself? There's blood on the leaves where I fell. Oh. Coming down. What I like about 
why that particular side is his anti-establishment, which I think is very, very yeah. fucking cool. The first thing I thought of was Donald Trump and literally the war, really, uh, if I'm honest. <laughs> I, don't, I, don't, I don't think he's referencing that. <laughs> oh, no, I think actually Donald was, Trump actually tainted anything to do with the war. <laughs> so like literally if you go like in your house yeah, and you yeah. say like listen just build a wall yeah it's like <laughs> build a wall build a wall yes <laughs> like, it's, it's like, not tall enough go up, it go was up. just it became like a slogan it's just become one of those things it's anyway. one of those things No, I need to actually. Like I need to just brilliant. go back. I like yeah, missed a thousand just, things. That there. was just too sick. Man. I love this. Hey, you the walker beast. Our monkeys are on the streets. Mona Lisa, this is art. Make her Mona Lisa. She needs mommy. That's fuck that. that. I'm just trying to. Our monkeys are on the streets. Mona Lisa, this is art. Make her Mona Lisa. She needs mommy. Mona Lisa, this is art. Um, uh, moan, at, uh, my moan at least she needs my meat. Moan at least she needs my meat. Mona Lisa, that's fucking yeah, 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 yeah. clever. That's that is clever. clever. But clever naughty, but clever. <laughs> yeah, you can get naughty. Why not? Capriced, our monkeys are on the streets. Mona Lisa, this is art. Make her Mona Lisa. She needs my meat. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo, hamid, abi, ali. I love that. Oh. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Like, when's, what's my next opponent? Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Yeah. You know, fucking. And then he uses Muhammad Ali. Give Muhammad Ali. Fire. Absolutely. Please to me, you may. Who's the G? Not me. I'm a regular guy. Halitosis with psychosis. Omens etched in my mind. Overdose on pills and potions. A collection of mine. Spit a value on a zany. And I mix it with wine. Oi, pull yourself together, mate. Pull yourself up, stand up straight. Look at you. You're such a mug. God, you're such a fucking stain. Honestly, I would. You know what I love about Ren is his level of um, introspection in terms of his ability to actually be self-aware. In all of his music, he's so good at being self-aware. But absolutely, bro. Uh, but not even, not even, not even just to his like strifes and tragedies, and it's it's actually even to I've I heard on a couple of tracks where he calls out his own characteristics and traits that he doesn't like about himself. Yeah, yeah. And then yeah, yeah. He, he puts will, himself on the freaking correct. Yeah, and there's right. always there's always like an inflection point on on those uh, um, lines, which I think is absolutely. But phenomenal. do you know how many people will resonate to him because of that? Because he's so open. Correct, so he's exactly. so open emotionally, so he's not holding anything back. He's saying, "This is who I am." It's like almost me, it's, like it's almost like a subliminal fourth wall to a certain degree because um, it's it's almost the fourth wall is when they, they try mean, to en- so a fourth wall is basically when in movies or music when they try to engage you, they make you part of the story. Oh, okay. So okay, like gotcha. literally, gotcha. so like in a movie, uh, it was uh, most prevalent in like House of Cards. So when you saw um, that, that was a series. Uh, uh, Frank Under what is his name Frank uh, Underwood. Underwood. Yeah, yeah. So Frank Underwood would would like talk, 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 and then turn to the TV and look at you uh, and yeah, talk yeah, okay. to you. So, is that the, so that's okay. breaking the fourth okay. wall. So that's brilliant. And that's what I think. And this is like almost subliminal in terms of him doing that. It's like he's psychologically doing that, not correct. not actually correct. Uh, um, doing it. But I think it's almost like he's staring at you. Correct. Yeah. yeah he yeah. did a part of that in uh, um, um, High Rain, where he actually mentioned the fourth wall as well, if I'm not mistaken. Was it High Rain? Uh, I, I can't actually catch you. I can't, I can't remember. But anyway, just see that with you in public. Don't press it. Sorry, 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 sorry. Sorry, sorry. Mix it with wine. Hey, pull yourself together, mate. Pull yourself up, stand up straight. Look at you, you're such a mug. God, you're such a fucking stain. Honestly, I wouldn't be seen that with you in public. Don't press it disorderly. It's like you fucking love it. Maybe you're right. Maybe it's friend. Do it again and again and again. Maybe I'm high. Maybe I'm man. To live in a cycle of anti-survival like man. In a prism life and shot the. The cadence here is the cadences here. The cadence switches here and the flows are absolutely. Yeah, look at this. So I'm like standing. Again, maybe I'm high. Maybe I'm meant to live in a cycle of undies to buy like man In a prism life and shot the iris of the land Make believe and play pretend God's my witness at the end With God as my witness I walk through the valley of the shadow of sickness I fear no evil This is almost like a prayer If God is my witness I walk through It's almost like he's telling God The shadow of death I will fear no evil And he says yeah, I fear evil Yes but over here what's so great is just God is my witness so I walk so through the valley of the sh- Okay sorry Look what's on there Yes It's Christ's Thorns. Oh, Did yes. What do they that? call that? Uh, I forgot what it's called. You know. Man. I know. You know more about scripture than I do. I know a lot about scripture, but I forgot what it's called. But in, in, anyway, I've just noticed that. God's my witness at the end. 
with God is my witness, I walk through. So he almost says, if God is my witness, yeah. right? And then I it's walk a, through sickness. It's, but even that's, even that's like a common phrase. So like it's a throwaway phrase. Yeah. Most people use it as a throwaway yeah. phrase. And even when you're talking to somebody, like, is, if God is my witness, I did this and this and this, whatever. Yeah. But he's literally saying, if God, like his question, if God is my witness, then hear me out. I'm oh, not man. walking through the shadow of, uh, of um, death. death. I'm walking through the shadow of sickness. So take a look. I walk through the shadows. I mean, just if you play, if you play that at rest, he actually captures the second part of it, which is absolutely phenomenal. Okay. Well, Even play pretend. God's my witness at the end. With God as my witness, I walk through the valley of the shadow of sickness. I fear no evil. I need no forgiveness. Deliver me from temptation. He never listens. I don't ever seem to feel well. Can anybody save yeah. me from myself? There's blood on the leaves where I fell. What he means by crave disorder is not literally like in the sense of wanting disorder, but again, it's so introspective in the sense of like, the the way society is right now it's all disorder so it's all just craving of disorder so um when he says it's almost like he's flipping that line where he's like crave disorder whatever is now seen as order crave the dis like yeah, crave yeah. the disorder of that so basically of, yeah. what's what, what what i like about what he's doing is if you actually think about if you think about music going 20 years back 30 years back yeah. right any sort of music that would be somewhat considered satanic hedonistic or um a, a, to a certain degree evil mm. that was the counterculture the yeah. culture the, the culture was creating music that was very in line with morals beliefs and 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 uh, um um to a certain degree um um sort of some sort of value system you hear you heard a lot with the bands and they would always you yeah. know they had that kind of thing that's all completely flipped if you see if you look at the mainstream right now the mainstream is all hedonistic and all of the it guys is. that are speak all of the guys that have real substance are pushed of pushed out yeah right so what's crazy is the flip on that from a societal standpoint and from a musicality standpoint is what used to be counterculture is now culture it's culture and now artists like this are the counterculture to that culture. Correct. That's what I fucking love about uh, um, Amrin. And that's what I think, that's how he's flipped the bar. That just, that His just, playing words is, is fantastic. And what I love about this is, is you know, when we walk through a sh shadow of, of death, I will yeah. fear no evil. Where he flipped it here. Yes, correct. He flipped exactly. it completely. Correct. So yeah, no, it's, 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 he's absolutely insane, man. No, it's brilliant. <laughs> From a musicality point, so very clever to play with the distortion mm. in terms of the distortion mm. in your mind and everything. See the number on the pull? I think it was 365. No, 345. 345. wonder what that signifies. What is 345? I was thinking if it's 365, it's obviously the number of days in the year. What's 345? There's a reason that's there. I, 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 and there's I don't know. 34 degrees on there. From what it looks like or three four nine like i, I love watching I everything actually, about him because he actually if you look at his yeah, you videos could, and stuff, there, there could be some easter eggs yeah, exactly yeah. but he put something in there for a reason whether you're going to spot it or catch it or not you know what i mean there's like a message with with regards could to be, what that's an interesting question maybe maybe that was a subliminal well look, just I like mean, you know the pig mask is subliminal like the pig mask is something nobody knows about 100 it's, it's your own interpretation of what that pig 100 percent. but the thing is that's why i asked on comments and I mean, on comments as well, if you maybe want to comment it, if you know what 345 actually is. That's if actually, they, or if you can speculate at all. I don't speculate at all. Yeah. I'd, I'd love to see the, okay. the, like, the fans' opinions, man. Shattered, my sword and my shield I find my refuge 
Come on, Jesus, man. no, that shit was crazy. Come on, man. That must that might be one of my favorite rain tracks. I must be honest. Real, I promise you, this is what I was saying now in the middle while we were actually watching it. I'm like going, this is this is a bit mind blowing at the moment. I wasn't expecting that. Fuck that shit. That, track that, is, that is very very good. Fire. And I mean, I, I mean, if this is what he's been releasing, um, the last I don't know what two three weeks that I haven't actually. Oh, geez, uh, I'm doing myself a disservice. Yeah. <laughs> like I really should be keeping no, no, no. up. I'm doing myself a disservice not knowing about Ren. Uh, I figured out, so basically, when I was introduced to Ren, what actually happened was I, I couldn't stop listening. And what I'll do is, I promised Phil actually that I will not listen to the songs, I will react the first time. So I would replay one song over and over and over again. I'm, I, I was like very, when you actually got into this game, I was very, very specific about that. Let's do yeah. not listen yeah. to anything. Like, but like High Ren, jump example, into it. I probably listened to it, I don't know. 17 18 times already and i pick up something new every single time which is crazy even in the car while i'm driving yeah i'm picking up something new and i'm like geez like i didn't spot that you know no, but it, he's absolutely. also so quick sometimes Abs on his lines you know anyway uh, guys that was absolutely incredible Ooh. uh so just to let you guys know also to introduce alex on my uh, channel as well um for those of you um who would like to actually support alex on his channel i'm leaving the link down in the pinned comment go to his channel subscribe to him we're literally all under the same umbrella um he, what's great about this whole sphere concept is that we're going to have different characters different viewpoints different perspectives we're different people at the end of the day we've got our own sort of different sticks yeah. and you might like it you might not like it but at least there'll be something for someone at any point in time and there will be a disastrous amount of content dropping i promise you we only we only at the beginning of this yeah. uh, fables fear story so yeah. um it's going to be absolutely epic so yes Very link exciting. down uh, to alex's channel link down is in the pinned comment you can click on that and there's going to be a lot more in reactions oh, you've still got to drop the um i know you've reacted suicide. to it oh suicide yes suicide. Correct. Suicide. Correct. Suicide. yeah that's what fine actually when you put it in when you put it in the cloud i actually sneakily watched it oh did you yeah yeah before it went on to fucking you cheating? youtube the fans should I, be watching the yeah, fans. Yeah, yeah, but I, I, I sneakily <laughs> watched it. That was, that was actually a very good reaction. But anyway, guys, thank you so much, man, for uh, tuning in. And uh, we'll catch you on the next one, man. Peace. Lots of love, guys. Cheers.